as referee Hines got things going. She was in charge of this game. And uh, there was St. Hilaire. Created a lot of problems. Sent the ball across to Sam. It should have done better, you think. But with the header, it went wide. And then the first goal headed in by St. Hilaire. He was right on spot. A really a poor mistake by goalkeeper Morris. He should have held it. And the ball came towards St. Hilaire. He put it into the back of the net. And then St. Hilaire with a cross. But it could not be finished by Sam. It went to Goddard. Sorry, to Garcia, who had the shot, a deflection. Then the corner, going to the far post. Garcia with the header. Morris just palmed it away, but he palmed it straight into the path of Brent Sam, who had his seventh goal for the season to make it 2-0 at halftime. We went into, just before the half, the, a chance coming to Aaron Johnson. And then Douglas with the follow-through, couldn't put the ball into the back of the net. And it was two goals to nil. The second half started. Corner again. And Justin Garcia with a shot. Henry was on the line to block it off. Then Cooper came in as a substitute together with Holder. Played a beauty of a ball through to uh, Holder. He rounded the keeper. Look at that ball. Wonderful ball. He rounded the keeper. And then just tapped it into an empty net to make it three goals to nil for defense force. And that's all they needed comfortable victory for them in the end a very efficient victory for defense force elite let's look at the stats 14 shots to five eight shots on target for defense force two to central fc nine fouls to two no yellow cards been a very clean game no red cards three offsides to two 11 corners for defense force uh, as opposed to two from central fc Two saves by uh, goalkeeper Bigot, but eight saves from goalkeeper Morris. But that start at the top in red tells you the story. Defense Force Elite 3, Central FC 2. Let's go down to Liu. He's got the man of the match with him. Thank you, Colin. I am here at tonight's man of the match. Keith on Central Air, you open, in this, you open the scoring for your team tonight. How pleased are you with your performance? Well, I'm pleased with my performance tonight. Um, I'm willing to put in some more work. To get more money match with play and um, I want to take it more forward with my team and push to get back on first place with my team. Absolutely, and of course you all won today. How important is it to keep winning as the title race is heating up? Oh, we have to keep winning to keep keep uh, keep winning the game, keeping every games we play and get better chances to go first pl first place because we win the last season and now we want to go back there and make it two times we win it. Absolutely, congratulations again, Keaton. Brent Sancho is with the coaches. Coach, despite the scoreline. Certainly some positives in this performance. Yes, we are. We played much better. We played one of the better teams. We are improving, but not fast enough. I mean, look at look at the, the goal that we concede. I mean, after 40 minutes, the keeper just, you know what I mean? These kind of things have been happening. But as I say, we have to continue to work to rectify them. Well, uh, congratulations on the, the performance and hopefully the positive side of things. Uh, improve your performance as, and all the best, of course, for the rest of the season. Thanks a lot. All Thank right. you very much, Coach. Coach, uh, of course... Uh, Three points was uh, always going to be important here tonight. Uh, your thoughts and assessment on the game? Well, we know the game would have been as easy as a lot of people thought. And once it's a competition and you're 